But something I was thinking about, I've been, I've been on the road, if that's what we folk singers do, since January. I was in New Zealand for a month singing, and then I've been here for a couple of weeks. And, I, and I've come to the realisation that just as songs get passed around, you know, and people learn them and sing them, the real folk tradition is the joke, right? You're looking at me like, what's a joke? <laughs> the joke, right? Because people tell a joke, and people hear it, and they go, oh, I could tell that but they mess it up, <laughs> don't they? <laughs> and then somebody else hears and says, well, I could tell that better. So they tell it, and they change it, and so on. And jokes, they could start here in Sydney on Friday, and by a week on Tuesday, it's over there in London being told differently, you know? So jokes go in themes, like folk song. I mean, folk, that was a song about whiskey, and a lot of folk songs involve drinking. Some of them involve love, some involve revenge, some involve uh, politics, some involve you know, romance, all kinds of the trickery. And, but jokes, I mean, there's a good series of jokes that all involve pubs. And a good example of that, here's an example of it. A man goes into a pub and the, van, the barman says, what would you like? He says, nothing for me, I don't drink. I've had one drink in my life, I didn't enjoy it. It was terrible. So one was enough, no more. The barman says, oh, I see. He says, well, um, would you, there's a smoking area out the back. Why don't you go and have a cigarette? <laughs> Funny you should mention it, he says. I, uh, I've only had one cigarette in my life too. I, it, didn't, it didn't agree with me at all. So one was quite enough. I've never done it since. Thank you very much. The barman says, well, why don't you have a game of pool? There's a table. Do that. Pass the time. He said, you know, you won't believe this, but I tried that once as well, you know, and I made <laughs> such a mess of it. I was so embarrassed. People laughed. I didn't do it again. The barman says, I see he said, well, you're in this pub, what are you doing here? He said, I'm waiting on my son. The barman says, ah, your only son, I assume. <laughs> <laughs>